I hope you enjoyed this temperature control lab for advanced control methods. Some of the things that we're going to be learning in this lab are how to model the system, how to create the differential and algebraic equations necessarily to predict the relationship between the heater and the temperature sensor. We're going to use both first principles as well as empirical models and then combine those two into a single model which is called a hybrid or a semi-empirical approach. Next we're going to move on to estimation where we update some of the parameters based on the data. So we're not just trying to predict from first principles, but we're trying to update in a Bayesian estimation approach where we get an additional piece of information, we update our model, and then move forward one time step, collect additional piece of information, and continue updating our model. The model almost becomes alive, like it's updating and responding to environmental changes. The other thing that we're going to be doing as a follow-on step to that is implement a model predictive controller. The model predictive controller is going to use that predictive model between the heater and the temperature sensor in order to make predictions into the future. Like you're driving, looking forward, you can anticipate changes, and you have a mental model or a mathematical model of how things are going to change in the future. We're going to use that with optimizers to rapidly adjust the heater values and be able to meet uh, desired target set points. As a final step, we're going to combine the estimation and the controller into a single application. That's going to be the culmination of this lab for advanced control methods where it updates the parameters based on the measurements, feeds those updated parameters to the model predictive controller, and then the model predictive controller produces new heater values that control the system. I hope you enjoy this lab this sequence of labs, and it will help you develop mathematical modeling, estimation, and control methods that utilize optimization solvers and some of the most advanced methods that are out there today.